Hi guys, welcome to Lisa Loves. I just noticed today that the trailer dropped. I have been asleep. What has happened? Who knows? The trailer has dropped for J.J. Abrams' new movie, Overlord. Right. I have to say, um, I've been doing some reading and I'm a little bit disappointed. I'm going to do a trailer reaction for this one. I haven't actually seen the trailer as yet. But the reason I'm a bit disappointed is there's been rumours all year that Overlord is going to be Cloverfield 4. Unfortunately, it looks like that's not going to be the case. JJ Abrams have said, has said, no, there's no link. Um, they are going to be working on part four of direct um, sequel to Cloverfield. So um, this one isn't going to be that, which is a little bit disappointing because I was really looking forward to that. I personally like all the entries in the Cloverfield. I even enjoyed Cloverfield Paradox. Not entirely sure why it went straight to Netflix, why it didn't get um, a cinematic release, but there we go. I enjoyed it for what it was. Um, so it sort of like raises a query, was it maybe going to be? And then after the reception for Paradox, did they change their mind? Who knows? But JJ Abrams has said no, it's in no way connected. So um, it's just a standalone movie. I don't know much about this movie. All I'm aware of is that it's set during World War II and that it follows some soldiers that are dropped behind, it's the, the D-Day landings, um, Normandy. They're dropped behind enemy lines and it's about all of the stuff that they see while they are there. So, I have yet to watch this trailer. Here goes. Three months ago, I was cutting grass in my front yard. And the mailman shows up with a letter from the army. Now I'm here. Cinematography is beautiful. No isn't idea it? where I'm gonna end up. my imagination linking the bell to ACDC, but it wasn't. There's a lot of soldiers out there. There's only four of us. Find out what's inside that compound. I do apologise, I got a bit distracted with a bit of ACDC. You can't not sing to the ACDC. That looks awesome. I can't wait to see that. They'll probably not put ACDC through it like, but I love to watch trailers when they put a kick-ass rock song in the background. This has got nothing to do with this, but when they did the trailer for... Um, with the Joker and Harlequin and all of that and Bohemian Rhapsody was um why can I not remember the name of that movie? You know the most Suicide Squad. And they put Bohemian Rhapsody in the background. Everyone knows Queen's my favourite band. I thought, oh my god, this looks absolutely amazing. I was so excited and I went to see it. 
It was crap. I'm sorry, there were a couple of characters in there that were really good, but big picture, it was crap. I was so disappointed. I hope this isn't going to disappoint. This trailer looks really fantastic. I love the special effects, I love the makeup, I love the eeriness of it. There's also that sort of like tie-in with, um, obviously we know that what it's going to show is not real, but there's that tie-in to the war and what the Nazis did and how grotesque and horrible and nasty it actually was. And these guys are the real monsters of the world. They were monsters. And it looks like they are going to concentrate a bit on some of the things that the Nazis were responsible for doing, as well as a lot of other stuff they're going to put on top, obviously. But to me, that always adds a bit of, like, it makes me feel a lot more tense and a lot more... It intensifies the fear for me because, so, you know, they don't even need to put monsters. I'm assuming there's going to be monsters of some description. They don't need to put supernatural stuff in for making a movie about this subject to be horrifying. They don't even need to do it. What happened is horrifying enough as it is. But this movie looks really, really good. I'm really excited about this. It looks brilliant. I don't know when this is actually coming out. Will this be coming out this year? Let's hope. Oh, it's on the screen in front of me. November 9th. Um, that'll be America. We'll probably get it a bit later in the UK. But yes, Overlord. Can't wait. What do you guys think? Um, do you think it looks any good? Are you disappointed it's not going to be Cloverfield 4? But we are getting a Cloverfield 4. Um, they're looking at possibly it coming out after the next Star Wars. Is it the ninth Star Wars? at the end of the year so we may get to see Cloverfield 4 2019 first half let's hope so yeah I'll leave that there for now um let me know what you think overnight from Lisa Loves